As the only outsider, Diane Watts brings a fresh new voice and vision to the BC Liberal leadership race. With her trusted reputation, proven leadership skills, and huge name recognition across BC, she is the most experienced and best known candidate in the field. We need a new voice, a new vision, and new ideas. Her 20 year record in public life is unblemished. Seven elections as a councillor, Surrey mayor, and MP without a loss. She was selected the fourth best mayor in the world and was recently named iconic leader of the decade for her years of public service by an international women's group. She gave her city credibility and encouraged many new businesses to move there. Watts is listening to the entrepreneurial voices in central and northern BC who believe new jobs and economic growth in the north are tied to projects like the Prince Rupert port expansion and the proposed energy projects. Really impressed with uh, the level of enthusiasm and interest that she has in Prince Rupert. Yes. She has been listening to Liberals in many of the towns and communities from Prince Rupert to Fort St. John, promising if she wins the leadership race, they will have a more inclusive role in the next Liberal government because working families here generate the forestry, resource and energy wealth that drives the provincial economy. I'm excited to work together with Diane and I'm going to see Diane win on February 3rd and I'm going to see Diane win the next election. Watts believes Site C's 100 years of clean energy is vital to BC's future and welcomes the NDP decision to continue building the dam. However, the uncertainty around the project has needlessly impacted the lives and jobs of its 2200 workers. We need to get on with it and we need to get these people back to work. I have seen the work that she has done. Diane can take this province and turn it. The forestry sector impacts 65,000 families. We need to ensure that we are growing the sector, that, that this sector is sustainable. At the leadership debate in Prince George, supporters wearing her yellow scarves believe Watts can energize the Liberal Party. I, I like her for the policy, what she's doing for the British uh, of Columbia. And if she can do the job that she did for the city of Surrey, I think it'll be a, a well-served for British Columbia. Oil and gas, LNG, hydroelectric, solar, wind, and other renewables. In other words, a common sense vision for the future. The big question for BC Liberals is who in the leadership race can win? Diane Watts believes she is the one. A trusted, respected name in public life, a listener, and a proven winner who passionately believes she can energize voters and lead her BC Liberals to victory in the next provincial election.